Part 1 Arm Anatomy In this video lesson, you will discover the bones and muscles of the upper and lower arm. I will make a quick sketch of an arm to show how it connects to the body. The shoulder blade, or scalpula, has a triangle shape. The upper arm bone, which is called the humerus, is connected to the shoulder blade via the ball and socket joint of the shoulder. From the name of this joint, you may conclude that the head of the humerus has a round shape. In fact, it is similar in the size and shape of a golf ball. This round shape allows movement and rotation of the arm in various directions. You may notice that the elbow is located on the same level as the lower edge of the ribcage. Keep that in mind each time you draw a human figure. As I mentioned, there are two bones in the lower arm. One is called the ulna, and the other is the radius. I will quickly sketch another arm. This time, the radius will be rotated around the ulna, forming the pronation position. As seen on this drawing, the radius now overlaps the ulna. You may notice that the ulna does not rotate. The radius travels around the bone. The deltoid muscle has three portions. We can see the front and side portions on this drawing. The front portion starts from the outer half of the collarbone. The side portion starts from the acromion of the shoulder blade. This muscle inserts into the humerus bone. The main function of this muscle is to raise the arm upward. <laughs> 